Alright, this is episode 7 of The Geordie Show. And today we got a guest of RMG. Yes, Warpat. We're going to go for a quick puff and have a quick interview with uh, Killer J. And we're going to ask him what's going on with the new seasons and stuff. And yeah. what's to be coming ahead. And then we're going to check out this awesome, awesome, awesome port of Doom. On the so. Sega 2, on the Sega 32X. Let's go. Don't cough at your organs, man. Oh man, I've already coughed up blood like the other day. Jesus. And tar too, man. Like oh. I gotta quit smoking soon. Yeah, well, it's, it's affecting me. It is. Yeah. I can admit that. I'm not gonna say, oh, it's just a cigarette. No, like you can kill you. Yeah. You smoke too long, man. Oh, hey, looks like it's getting nicer up here. Yeah. Oh, Two of 27. Nah, it's still a little chilly there. It's still chilly on my willy. Yeah, it is still chilly on my willy too, man. Yes. The weather too. Yeah, but you know, there, so we got some promise going on. We got some promise in RMG land. Oh, stronger yeah. smoke. The yellow filters are not the strong ones. The brown ones are. I got jazz and strong cigarettes. Yeah. How you doing, fella? All right. Yo. Yes, there. Yeah. Not as nice as yesterday. Oh, I know what you're saying. I, know. <laughs> I agree. I agree. <laughs> yeah, this is, you know, Jordy's show. Lightning's on it because, you know, whatever. He's not doing his, not doing his fair share of the bargain, I guess. Just sleeping in. So all we got Warpat here, and we got Killer J on the set. Yeah. We got Killer J on the set. Your interviewer going to be interviewing this guy. Questions to be asked, I shall answer all of them the best that I can. Yeah, what do you think of the fans of RMG? I fucking love them, to be honest. I really do. Like, I, yeah. I love the fans. Like, yeah, fans of the shit. Yeah, that's what we needed. But we got it now. <laughs> yeah, if there's any more games, send it to my inbox. Me and Warpat will try to review those games. As and we got games on my flash drive, too, so we're not going to run out of games. I'm going to be constantly downloading them. And yeah. I know I'm using an emulator, but, but I still know what I'm talking about. Yes, because he grew up with these games. This guy, this guy right here, is an old school gamer. He's not a new school gamer because he grew up fondly with those games. He enjoys them to this day. Still, well, still. I love them to this. I love them to death. Like I, I grew up with Double Dragon. I grew up with Mario. I grew up with friggin' Zelda. I yeah. grew up with all this stuff. You, you new school gamers, you can play your games and fine. Just don't act like assholes. You play your Halos, you play your Call of Duties, but in all moderation, you gotta pay respect to the classics. The classics are what, what the industry's thrived off of, built on. Why do you think these games, these these older games, still people play them because they're tired of the new systems? Because the new systems... New systems just demand money. Emulators are free. Yeah, well, new systems, they've... Tr new games, they charge at least 60 to $80 per game. Yeah, and, and you, know, it's you only can go online and just, you know, pay 30 bucks a month for, like, a million. Yeah. Maybe it runs, and you know what? I have 7 gigabytes on my game drive. Yeah. Okay? And I only got 2 gigabytes taken out of it. So I got, like, how many gigabytes left? I got a shitload. Yeah. And all those games that you see, even the emulators themselves, I got, like, 6 emulators. Yeah. One's for arcade, one, yeah, one is for Nintendo 64, one Super Nintendo, one Sega, and one is NES, and one is Game Boy Advance. Yeah. It's all good stuff in the Jory show, because this show is coming back, and RMG is coming back with a vengeance. We're not fucking. Pat smoking on screen again, like always, an RMG tradition. Warpat isn't Warpat without a fucking cigarette on to his hand, man. I'm telling you, it's not the Warpat persona. Yeah. Me is Liam kicking himself in the ass persona. Any other questions for me there, Jay? What do you think of the RMG season nine? It's going to be good shit, man. I'm telling you. Watch New it. shit off the walls. Watch it. Watch it, man. All you fans of RMG. All the fans of RMG. Hey, watch and as for that, uh, who's been sending in all these requests anyway? Anyway, I, I got to send a shout out to that person. It's, uh, go, come back. It's, uh, Fast and Furious. Take a leap. That's where we're going to go. Go ahead. Go on it. All right. Yeah. So who is it? Fast and Furious 450? And uh, TPG Gaming uh, uh, HD. Well, you know what? Keep sending in requests, boys. Yeah, keep, it, keep it up. Oh my god, texture with the texture. Dun, dun, dun. 
Sounds pretty decent on the 32X, the Doom soundtrack. Hi. Yeah. yeah. The Jordy Show was a good rendition. It's like, you know, we're going to try to get more guests on and try to get Marcus and all them. The rest of the RMG Alliance. Sunshine do. Ask her a few questions. I like the action on the screen, by the way. I like the older games, too. So, the older games were... The graphics weren't the best thing of them, but they're, it's their playability through the roof. So, yes. The Jory Show is kicking it up. Kicking up a notch, actually. Yay! Boom! Oh, he died. Poor guy. Hi, uh, whistling. Yeah. One thing that one has got to start doing is laying out the coffee, boys. Yeah. Going to the bathroom way too much, man. Yeah. All right, let's crack this mother open. <sighs> yeah. And this is Doom 1 on the Sega 32X. Done with K Fusion. Yeah. Who's your favorite reviewers? Right now, Alpha's up there in my top faves, and you, obviously. Yeah. What was your favorite RMG review? I'd still say the first review I was ever in. Yeah. You like any of Kyle Cummins videos? Oh, well, Kyle Cummins got some talent, that's for sure, and you know he knows where he's going. He's going places. Yeah. That's why he he's what me and him are what made RMG to what it is today. And you had a big part of it too, and Marcus. So. All, all four of us made RMG to what it is today. So let's show a little screenshot of this there. and Let's get some gameplay going on, some footage. Yeah, well, this is going to be a different Jordy show. Interview plus gameplay. Plus interview and gameplay. And secret revealing too, why not? Why not? Do all the good stuff. And uh, as for that, you know, that would be pretty good. But yeah. for Jordy show, you know, it's a, it's a good thing. Yeah, it's a good show. Come on, yeah, yeah. Take that, you empty. Takes a lot of shots, though. And the though. pixelated blood looks pretty fluent in this one. It actually looks pretty realistic. Yeah. I put the rendering in a little bit smoother, too, so... <laughs> the textures don't look as, uh... Crap. Entering, levering, too. See how my, uh, offset is a little off on that side? It looks a little it's no, it's not a big deal. It's yeah, this was Doom 1 on the Sega 32X, basically, and this is my emulator using. Yes. I'm using, so, yeah, and let's see what else I got going on. Oh, what is Xenas going on here? I got that, too. Let's see what games I got going on. You got a lot of them. Oh, I had a shitload more when I was younger. Yeah. Imagine that. Konami. A good company. Ooh. What do you think of Super Castlevania 4? I think it's the shit. I yeah. just think Castlevania is like a good game. Yeah, it's a good series. It's just amazing. Like, except for Dracula, that's hard as shit. Harder than monkey tits. You're damn right, man. Especially gorilla tits, man. Or old. No, I'm not gonna say old lady tits. Just sag down to the ground. Oh, I like cats. Yes. The Jordy Show is your show of all shows. On uh, if there's any questions, if any one of the RMG people are want to be interviewed on the Jory show, just send it there and I'll interview you, interview you guys. So yes, you see my face on camera for a change there because Warpats likes the camera and not that he's a bad guy or anything, he just he wants to help out the gaming funds. Basically.
I just want to get him to ulterior heights. Get RNG to a future that's well known. Let's see what else I got going on. You got Mortal Kombat, that's a good series. Oh yeah, I got all three. I also got, well I got all four for the uh, Nintendo systems. Yeah. You want to see something cool? Yeah, why not? Like see this for a minute. Let's see. Back. You ain't got Mortal Kombat 4? Yeah, it's right here. I grew up with, I grew up playing that one. Mortal Kombat 4. That's a good one. People, people say it's 3D, so... It is pretty good, yeah. It's 3D Check for a really out. good fighting game, though. I'll go on my arcade emulator for a minute. Yeah. Capcom versus SMK. <sighs> what? Kazintite. Thank you. There. Yeah, well... And let's see if we can try Street Fighters versus X-Men. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Got some of the Street Fighter characters in there. It's actually pretty cool. Got Pat's favorite character, low well known fact, Ryu, or Ryu. Gambit. Ryu, Jago, Wolverine. Uh, Scorpion. Those are some of my favorite characters. Yeah. What was your least favorite Mortal Kombat game? I'd say one. One? What was your favorite Mortal Kombat game? Two. Two? Everybody likes that one for some reason. Because it's just, it's got Reptile, man. Yeah. Well, so does Mortal Kombat 1, but you gotta go through so much cryptic shit to get to play those things. Yeah, to go through all the cryptic codes and all that. Well, no, not cryptic codes, basically. You gotta go through all this like, cryptic Nintendo bullshit like James once said. Yeah, well... You gotta go through so many series of matches and do certain things in the matches and win certain ways, and then yeah, Reptile fine. becomes available and it just looks like Scorpion. Yeah, what well, you have to be a Mortal Kombat veteran to do all that stuff. That's what I'm saying. But I'm not a Mortal Kombat veteran, I'm just a casual enthusiast. So i just say that right now. I still like fighting games. Mortal Kombat's my favorite series of fighting games. I don't know, Street Fighters is mine. I grew up with Street Fighters. And yeah, well, that's his opinion. I'm not changing his opinion, that's his opinion. He's tied to his own opinion. He likes Street Fighter because that's his favorite game. So does Killer Instinct, though. I used to play it on arcade, the original arcade. Yeah. Too bad all those games. It's good that we got emulators and computers these days to play our older classics. Yeah, no, as long as it, you, know, you can run it. Yeah, it depends what ROM you get. Cajun Striker. Any other questions you want me to ask you? Not really. It's, it's cool, man. You want me to end it? If, if, yeah, well, no, you can just watch the you know, see the gameplay like, that we're showing, like the coin operated shit. Ooh. I'm almost out of. Oh my gosh. I'm not KO. Yes, the Joy Show is my show. Mm -hmm. If you want to come on the Joy Show, you can and watch it and support it. The Joy Show is going to be some, with some, some gaming related stuff. It's not going to be just interviewing people. It's going to take it to a whole new level of show in this. <laughs> show in this. Yeah. Nice. Magneto. I'll uh, show you another game I got on the classic arcade system. This show, video's been going on for 14 minutes and 18, uh, 10 seconds. It's been going pretty strong so far. This is Street Fighter Alpha 3! <laughs> yeah. In Canada. Got some cool characters in there. Vega. It's good to have arcade at home without having to put in coins and shit. Yeah, that's it's that's that's the good thing about ROMs these days. And it's also two player too, like it's pretty neat. Pretty neat stuff. There's Blanca. Go for pro ho. I mean pro. The Blanca or what? I'm good with Zangi up on Super Street Fighter 4. 
Then I guess I'll do my charge attack. You're not even doing anything, Ken. You're just. I know, I put it that way. Oh, okay. Look, he's hulking up. Set him. I get closer to him. <laughs> Making him jump all around and stuff. Well, basically, I can do this roll attack. Hey. Alright. That's pretty good stuff. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Parents home? <laughs> Parents are at home? Cappy's at home. Oh, okay, they're all at home, I bet. Like, if uh, she's allowed to go somewhere, then I guess I don't have to be watching them, so. Yeah. Oh, what a slap. <laughs> just, just a, just a, yeah. just a female dog slap. Okay, so there's Street Fighter's Alpha 3. Okay, let's see what else I got. Um, Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Good hot today. Hey, you met me. Hey, hey, hey. Je m'appelle Fat Albert. Don't get a Prince Albert. Prince Albert in a can. You better let him out. Yeah. It was actually hurt the dick. Sorry for saying that word. It is. It's a medical term. That's pretty damn neat, eh? Yeah. Want to end it now? If you want to. Alright, this is the Joy Show episode 7. It's been going on for quite some time, and it's it's been the record most consistent longest episode ever. No, usually the joy shows are much shorter in detail, but still it's good stuff. So check out the channel, subscribe, and do all that good stuff. And watch my older watch RMG's older reviews. If you want to don't I know the newer stuff's just as good as the older ones, but you know. Peace out.